Welcome Aries to your weekly reading. This is for the 25th of December to the 1st of January. For all my Aries who are celebrating Christmas this week, I want to wish you the most wonderful and joyous Christmas. We are going to go ahead and see all the possible energies and messages coming through for you for this week. Aries, I'm going to start off by looking at the first row as the possible energy beginning the week. The second row is going to be the area you should focus on. The third row is the unexpected energy coming in. The fourth row is messages and advice from spirit. And finally, our fifth row is the possible outcome of the week. Aries, this is a collective reading, so take what resonates and leave the rest. We are going to start off here with a Wheel of Fortune and I'm just going to get your clarifier. So we just want to see now what this Wheel of Fortune energy is for. Aries, please. Right, let's see Aries. We have got Temperance. My dear Aries, as we enter into the last week of 2023, we are being told there is a big energy of change coming in. The wheel of fortune tells us the wheel turns and it's turning in your favor. With that, we are also being told that whatever this change is, you have been waiting for it. So my dear Aries, it could be anything. It could be that the new year brings new opportunities like a new job, starting a new business. Maybe you're deciding to move, relocate in some way. With our angel coming in with her rainbow wings and the rainbow in the background, we know and understand whatever this change is, it's not a minor change that's coming your way. It's something that gives you our rainbow energy and rainbows are filled with hope and blessing. So my dear Aries, this change that we see coming in at the beginning of the week is something you've wanted, something you've perhaps prayed and wished for. And now we see great possibility of this starting to happen as the week unfolds. Let's move on and see what the Six of Swords energy is that is sitting in the area that you should focus on. So we just want to see now what this Six of Swords energy is for. Aries, please. And we have the Fool. How lovely, Aries. Aries, you are being asked to focus on this big change that is happening. Because now we have two cards confirming what this change could be for you. The first card is our Six of Swords, which tells me that whatever this change is, you are leaving behind something that was not right. This is our turbulent water here. This could have been a challenging period, being unhappy in a relationship or in a job. It could have been anything, but you're moving out of it and you're moving into far better and easier times. With that, my dear Aries, we get the full and the full is the energy of fresh new beginnings, ready to take chances, ready to take a leap of faith into the unknown. So, all focus, all energy this week on what this could be for you. Now, this is perfect timing because we're closing off a year. So this week, you put all your awareness, all your focus on what this change and this new beginning is for you. Because, my dear Aries, there's going to be a lot of blessings and happiness around it. Very positive so far. Now let us see what the Six of Wands is that is sitting in your unexpected. Right, let us see now what the Six of Wands energy is for 
Aries, please. The Ace of Wands. My gosh, Aries, you have a really wonderful last week of 2023 coming in. Unexpectedly, we have the Six of Wands coming in. Six of Wands, my dear Aries, is the card of victory, the card of success. Here we see our rider on his white horse holding up the wand of infinite possibility with the victory wreath on the wand and on his head we have the victory wreath. We see that this week there is a wonderful energy of the feeling of accomplishment, the feeling of I know what I've been through, I've accomplished what I set out to do and I am excited and ready to move forward into the new year with this energy of a very deep and meaningful victory. With that, we have the beautiful card of Ace of Wands coming in. Hand of God is coming in with the Wand of Infinite Possibility. And we saw you holding the wand here with the victory wreath. So we know, my dear Aries, that whatever this is that's coming in, and we saw that with our rainbow angel and the rainbow in the background, is blessed. And here the hand of God gives you the wand of infinite possibility. It's like here, Aries, I'm giving you something spectacular. I'm giving you an incredible chance, an incredible possibility. It's up to you now to take it and make something of it. And we see that you do immediately. There's no hesitation here, Aries. With the six of wands coming in here, it tells me that what Whatever this is for you that's coming in, whatever this change is, this move is, you see it immediately. You acknowledge possibility immediately and you claim it and you work it. That you ensure that the outcome is exactly how you want it to be. So unexpectedly, my dear Aries, we see no hesitation from you. We see no second guessing. You are completely ignited with where you are going and what you want and you are about to seize every opportunity that comes your way and you maximize it to ensure total success. Very, very wonderful to see. Let's move on and see what our page of cups is all about that is sitting in messages and advice from spirit. So we want to see now what this Page of Cups energy is for Aries, please. The Hanged Man. Aries Spirit is coming in and they want you to know that this period of waiting for a change that is coming in this week was very important. You know, sometimes Aries, when we have to wait for something and we can almost taste it, but it's not happening. There's still a waiting period. It can make us really question everything. Spirit wants you to know that for you, the waiting period was very important because while you were in hanged man energy, which is the energy, my dear Aries, of being in God's waiting room, you gained new perspective, you gained new insights so that when the wheel of fortune came in, you would recognize opportunity, you would recognize blessings and you would seize the moment. Spirit wants you to know that this week you will hear something with regards to this change, this beautiful opportunity coming in. It will be surprising, it will be unexpected, but you will hear something. And this is Spirit letting you know, Aries, you held in there, you waited, you did the work, you were patient, and now you are going to be rewarded. Lovely, my dear Aries, what a wonderful, uplifting way to end the year. Let's see now what our Five of Cups energy is that is sitting in the possible outcome of the week. Right, let us see now what the Five of Cups energy is for 
Aries, please. The Knight of Swords. Aries, this Five of Cups energy is just for some of my Aries who might have had a particularly hard time waiting for this beautiful energy to come into play. And Spirit is just wanting you to know that they understand that this could have been a challenging time and that was our rough waters over there. But you're moving on. Five of Cups is the energy of really looking at our cups that have fallen over, the energy of crying over spilt milk and not being able to see what is still possible and still standing. And Spirit wants you to know that this energy now is naturally ending, is naturally dissipating as our beautiful change comes in. You will, my dear Aries, be able to turn around and focus on the cups that are still standing. What we see with our Knight of Swords coming in is that as this change comes in, my gosh, my dearest Aries, from your side, you seize what this opportunity is. You claim the victory, you claim the success, and you move into the new year full steam ahead. You have no doubt that you are on the right track. Can you see how our knight is charging into 2024? Even our horse has a surprised look on his face at the speed that you are going to be going. This energy, my dear Aries, was just a moment in time and it's completely understandable because when we are in God's waiting room, we don't know when things are going to happen, when things are going to change, but you're going to feel the change this week in a very significant way and into 2024 you go with the energy of excitement, inspiration and knowing you are on the right track. Let's move on and get a message from your angels for the week. Right, let us see now what Aries angels would like to share with them for this week, please. Remain positive. My dear Aries, this message, remain positive, is just for some of my Aries who could have or are still experiencing our Five of Cups energy. You are being asked by your angels to remain positive. This energy is already in flow. How it will manifest and at what speed it manifests will be very different for everybody. The trick here is to focus on the two cups standing wait for that news to come in because we saw very early in the week the wheel of fortune comes in and you're going to feel the energy of this blessed change happening so keep the faith my dear aries it's about to happen so that is all i have for you right now i wish you the most wonderful last week of 2023 and may you close this year off with grace and ease and walk into the new year ready for the wonderful things that are about to come in. I thank you all for your love and support throughout the year and I'm sending you all so much love.